Dr. Victor here. Today we will continue with our fasting series and we'll discuss about people that shouldn't fast or people that have to be more careful when fasting. So let's begin. So of course there are some groups of people that shouldn't fast and they can worsen their illness if they fast. So the first category would be cachexia, so people that are underweight. Of course for these people fasting is not an intelligent strategy because they are already underweight. Also those with anorexia or other eating disorders. Also certain chronic illnesses such as uncontrolled hyperthyroidism, advanced cerebrovascular insufficiency or dementia, advanced liver or kidney insufficiency, pregnancy or nursing. So for a pregnant woman and a woman that is nursing, we need more fasting studies to see the exact effects. And finally, diabetic patients on drugs with risk of hypoglycemia. Because of course, if you are on a hypoglycemic medication, such as insulin treatment, sulfonylurea, and you are also fasting, there is an increased risk of hypoglycemia. Also, there are certain groups of people that while fasting should be accompanied by an experienced physician to look at their treatment. For example, people that are under treatment for certain addictions, type 1 diabetes, psychotic disorders, unstable or severe coronary artery disease, retinal detachment, peptic ulcer, so gastric or duodenal ulcer, and finally cancer and malignant disease. Here is a list of some medication that needs to be adjusted while fasting, so speak with your physician. Non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs, so NSAIDs, systemic corticoids, antihypertensives, especially beta blockers and diuretics, anti-diabetic drugs, contraceptives, anticoagulants, psychotropics and anticonvulsivants because fasting can influence the absorption and the effect of these medications. So, fasting has benefits, but these are the groups of people that should try fasting only under the supervision and with the aid of a physician. So, thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed the video, found it useful, don't forget to like, subscribe if you enjoyed the content, and we'll see each other in the next video when we're gonna talk about fasting and muscle mass, what are the effects. We'll see each other next time. Salute!